By chance, he and I crossed paths in a neutral setting. Didn't give me his name. Just called himself a drifter. Told him that if that's how it was, he could call me pal. He laughed at that and got comfortable. Got all kinds of open about where he'd been, what he was hauling, even dropped a tip on where an old friend of mine was hiding. Still wondered if he knew who I really am. He told me he left the system as soon as it was risen. Not immediately, sure. Had to get his bearings, find a ship, get fit, get it flying. Soon as he was good as gone. Drawn to the outer, he says. I can appreciate. He says he's seen the deep side of Jupiter. Been to the core mines of Saturn, name drops, old myths no one's heard. The alluvial crux, the shift chasms below Elios and the fourth tomb of Nazarak. Goes on about the idols of Lower Soul, the treasure of Exodus Prime. Soul engine of the Death Star Six. I think he's making most of it up. But he's got relics and etchings. Got materials not of this system. Old metal, odd metals, obsidian flames. Thought engines, edible null cakes, and a stuffed something that looks like a rabbit bio fused with a cellophod. He keeps all his stuff to himself. His gets, he calls them. If they're for show, they put on a great one. But to what end? The clutter of oddities he's got shipside ain't nothing compared to what he's hauling. That big black mass of nothing you have ain't never seen before. He calls it an artifact. But it's more than that. The state know what exactly. He said he got far out as he's ever been. Said it was from a place cold enough to snuff out your light. I asked him if it was Bex. Live. Cagey as all. He said no. He was just other. And it was powerful. Maybe. That was his qualifier. Maybe. Why the hell bring it into the inner system then? Maybe he's a trouble. But he's got an answer for everything, he says. Brother, maybes are where the real treasure hides. He could tell I wasn't satisfied, but I knew he wasn't lying. Chunk was other for sure, and Ghost said its readings were off the chart, but abstract, unlike anything anyone had ever encountered. Can't say that made me comfortable, but then the drifter with his easy manner. An eager charm asked if I'd ever met a man in black named Pal Callum. He was clearly changing the subject, but he was lucky enough, or smart enough, to pick one I had an interest in. And I could respect that. 